Hello everybody, welcome back to our channel. I'm Lynn and of course that's the old man. Happy holidays folks and welcome back to Robin Lynn on tour in the motorhome going away again. <sighs> yes again and neither of us are feeling very well. No. Um, I don't know what it is, we must have a bug. I feel like we've got a permanent hangover and I promise you it isn't. Uh, it, look, well, it's, we haven't got what our granddaughter's got. I think we said on our last vlog that she was poorly and she got chicken pox. And it's not chicken pox, she's got measles and she is so poorly with it, isn't she? Yeah, since we've seen, seen her, we haven't been very well. No, we haven't got measles. I no. just, I don't, I just, I don't know. We just got a, picked a bug up or something. We were in two I've, minds. Uh, I've checked Lynn all over to make sure she hasn't got a rash. We were actually in two minds whether to go away this weekend, but we've got no plans if we stayed or went to the static. We've got no plans to do anything, so we thought, well, we might as well carry on and go away. We're not going away with friends or anything, just us this yeah. week. Just going to have a uh, job looking forward to oh, oh, slow down, Rob. The car was parked a bit too further into the road, he was turning right. Unbelievable, man, that one is traffic jams everywhere. People don't get in the right bloody lanes. Unbelievable. So you're looking forward to this weekend? Yes, I am. It's uh, it's going to be a little bit different, but we'll tell you more about that when we get there. But I'm sure whenever we go, we'll have a great time. We will, if I feel better. I haven't eaten yet today. I just feel that. There. There. Bloody jumper on again. I know, I know, because it's, you know, like I said, it's my cosy jumper, and because I, I didn't feel very well. I got up this morning, I had a shower and everything, and I just, oh, I'll put my cosy top back on. Hey, folks, what do you think about the uh, the chairs that we got? Oh, Second hand chairs. I know, amazing, absolutely. For those amazing. who don't know, we bought two uh, Isabella chairs for 115 quid, was it? Yeah, something like that. Yeah, 115, and that's like how much they are each. And they are like brand new, folks. They are an absolute bomb. Yes, there was a couple of marks on the one which wiped off easily, so really, really happy with that. The only thing I'm not happy about is he hasn't put them in the bus. No, I'm not going to use them until the summer. And then the plan is, because they take up so much room, because they're big, yes. is uh, when we you know, chuck them on the bed to travel, and then when we get there, we'll chuck them under the van. In the bag, because they come with a proper bag as well. Uh, yeah. Oh, we've also been picked up on, uh, you've got to be careful of uh, Facebook Marketplace because of scammers. Oh, we know. Well, so we, we are well aware of that. Yes, I, I've sold a few things on uh, Facebook Marketplace, and the first 10, people that ask for you know ask about the product is can they swap it can they get a courier can they pay by paypal yeah. and you know you, you just know straight away that they're scammed so i just let me block and report them in yeah so for those yeah. who don't know if you are buying something off uh, facebook marketplace be very very careful yeah it's worse i think selling it's it's uh it's like if you're buying something as long as you go and see it and well like like we didn't do like we said the son-in-law to do but yeah if you're buying you I think you're a bit better uh, as long as it's not a motorhome because there's lots of scammers on Facebook marketplace with motorhomes and caravans yeah but what we do we always check them out as much as we oh can. I do I, I go onto their profile and have a, have a good research even if they're buying off of me I always do that yeah. but the other bargain place is Vinted but I'll tell you about that more later He's not, he's not happy. Unbelievable. Yeah, we'll, we'll talk about that later, right? Eh? Let's crack on. Yes, on to our destination. I love being in the bus feed, people. You can't whack it. No. Oh, shoot me now. I forgot my gun. Uh, bit of drama here in uh, going on the M5. There's a crane. Is it a lorry with a crane on it? It's a crane. Yeah. No, not a crane, a digger. Some kind of digger. And it's hit the bridge. Under the M5. We thought there was something going on. You have to excuse me because I'm eating. Yeah, look at that man. Oh no. My son's at work today, I wonder if he's there. Hey, it might be. How about that then? Somebody's in for the sack. I'm just eating my favourite biscuits, which are the all butter shortbread fingers. But they're very sticky mouth together. Yeah. I do, don't they? Yeah. I can hardly talk. I'll get some more. Oh, sun's out. Happy with that. And the Empire's running smoothly at the moment. Not good today. More drama now. Wow. Gosh, I hope everyone got out of that. Okay. 
more drama on the motorways. Well, there's another one smashed up here as well. Yeah, it's the one it must have hit. I don't know. Well, I was just saying, I just don't like smart motorways. I think they are that, so man. dangerous. Airbags gone off. I hope they're okay. Yeah. They're so... They're good to think that it frees up the traffic on the motorways. But if somebody breaks down, it's just awful, isn't it? I mean, for them patrolling ones, the ones with the camera, to shut the motorways well, down quickly. Police, that's illegal. What? Police are going along the... Yeah, I'm sure they shouldn't be in the hard shoulder. I don't know. Send him off. Why in the window game? Shut up, please. Right. It's a woman. Well, we're nearly here. It's been a mammoth journey with the roadworks and the accidents and everything on the motorways. So this week we are having a weekend of a difference again. We've done it before, we did it this time last year. We are near a very pretty river. And look, we... And the road tax around. Oh. Jesus Christ, you know all the money road tax now, of course. Well, they sort the bloody roads in. Right, we're just over half a mile away, so can I let them know where we're bloody going? Bloody ridiculous. We, we did it, we did it, I think it was this time last year. We are camping at Loudham's Caravans, and we're here. Um, it's £6 a night, and the money goes for charity, and you can have a look around the caravans and the motorhomes. So that is what we're going to do. We've had a look on site, on, online, and they have got lots of stock in. And we're camping over... There somewhere over where? I don't know. Oh, over there. That was where we were last year. We've so we'll. Uh, no, we haven't. So we'll crack on. He said, if there's a calf, which I know there is, he's going to take me for lunch. If it's cheap enough. No, it's not cheap. She's just about to shut the gate, I think. Is she? So yeah, we'll uh, see what it's like here this weekend. Right, folks, we've just parked up. No. Believe it or not, we can't get on until three o'clock, which to me is bloody ridiculous. It is, but that's that's I did check, and that's what it did say on the rally arrival time th after three p.m. Yeah. So. And can we just say a massive thank you to what was his name? Didn't catch his. He didn't give us his name. A bloke just followed us, pulled up, got out the car, and gave us a drink to have a drink. Thank you so much. Yes, Very thank nice you. bloke. Thank you. He chased us down, didn't he? Yeah. Sorry, we can't, we we didn't get your name, but. Uh, Apparently he's just bought uh, a narrowboat. No, he hasn't recently bought it, he's regretting buying it. Yeah, he's regretting buying the narrowboat. Yeah. For some reason. He used to have a motorhome, but now he bought a narrowboat, so I said, do you want a swap? Yeah, and he regrets it. Right, come on. Hang on. Show me code. <sighs> Yet another coat. Yeah, but my daughter bought me this. Literally the same day or the day after that we went to Worcester and I bought mine. She bought this, but it's from Vinted. And it looks brand new. Well, yeah, it's got no wear at all. It's just amazing. And she paid a fraction of what? 25 quid. 25 quid, folks. She says that. We don't, we think that she's telling a few porkies, don't we? I don't know, because she's tight like me. That's very true. I mean, give us a tour. 25 quid. So I deliberately didn't bring my coat with me today because I knew we were going to go home to pick this parcel up today. Happy. Happy. Give us a kiss. Yeah. Come on, give us a little kiss. In the give me a little kiss. Then. No, we're not doing. We're not doing motorhomes, caravans, tents, subscribers, old and new, anything. We're having food. We'll see. I should definitely be having a look at that one tomorrow. Ninety thousand pound on a seventy-two plate. Beautiful. Accompanied viewing only. Please ask a member of the camp at van department. All oh, right, you've got to not open. No. I'm not surprised. When we came here last year, the abuse some of these vans had had. Yeah. From people just walking around. Which is a shame. Loads of windows, look, George. Very high top. Grand California. So that is factory 
fitted by VW. If it's got California on the back, all the rest have been converted by other people. Yes, fan yeah. conversions. Yeah. Yes, so whatever your name was, we don't know your name, but you're a lovely man. But we've just bought two beef sandwiches, two coffees, so thank you again so much. Yes, thank you. I'll keep pretty. Yes, we'll probably be looking at these vans in detail tomorrow, folks. Where's she gone? There she is, look. A little barber go down. What's the sandwich like? Beautiful. Is it worth 20 quid? No comment. <laughs> Watch your fingers. Mm. The amount of meat that's on it though. Is it worth 20 quid? Yeah. What? Yeah. Do you have another laugh? No. <laughs> Give us a kiss. Go on, you can do this. Mm. There's a beautiful panel van over there. Mm. Can you see it from here? Mm. Man, it is so nice. Yeah, we'll do all that tomorrow. I mean, it's very nice. I think even you would like it. Mm, you can see it. Go on, give us a kiss. No, go away. What's this? Yeah, we are eating very healthily, uh, no people. There's that stuff for crisp in my face. But I don't know why, but I'm putting weight on instead of losing it. Oh, for from eating. Oh, yeah. Let's have a look at the vans. That was absolutely bang on. Beautiful. And like I've just said, it worked out at £9.25 for a coffee, sandwich, salad, crisps. It was lovely. Worth it. Yeah, you don't, you don't mind paying if it's a food good, and it was really, really Well, we didn't pay anybody. No, but you're paying tomorrow. That lovely gentleman paid. Yeah, but you're paying tomorrow. No, I'll have another one. You just said you're coming back in to go again tomorrow. No, I was trying to be nice, so I'll get a snog later. There's some beautiful vans here. There is. Well, Come on, out of here. No, out did, of here. Yes, I know. I did say we weren't going to have a look around vans today. We're just having something to eat and going back to the van. Well, but we'll just do this, this one here. It's the new Swift Ascari. And to me, it's, a, it's a, more like a panel van. Look at the cooker. And the sink. Yeah, it's uh, even though it's coach built. Seventy-two grand, I think. Tiny sink, fridge there. Is that is that locked or? I don't like forcing things, especially when they're brand new. Do you want me to do it? No, because you will break it. Yeah, there's a wet room in there. Room. <coughs> I've got a bag of some of that sandwich. You might go away, I mean, it's just my layout, isn't it? It's just, it's just that that I you know. like. Nothing else. No, I do. I like, yeah, I don't like the kitchen area. Loads of storage, though. Well, three cupboards each side. Windows, plenty of lights. That's what I like about vans. Windows. That's what I like about... The skylight up there. About the U-shaped lounge, because you've got light yeah. everywhere. Wait till you see this panel, then. I'm not looking at it. Look. And the Fiat cab. A couple of travel seats there. Nice covers. Nice van. Seems a bit narrow there to me. But, yeah, lovely it's a very van. nice van. I'll show you outside like quickly, the music stopped. There you go, 74 grand. Uh, Ascari 372. That colour's getting quite common now as well. Nice wheels. Nice van. Very nice, sir. Yes. I've been uh, emptying it by the looks of it. Uh oh. Get out of there! Now I have been in this van earlier. It was 105,390, reduced to 1,000, we wish. 103,040 pounds. <coughs> what is it? Uh, the uh, Contiki Grand Prix. Nice one. Let me show you around it first. I don't know why they put that on motor rooms. Yeah, 774. 
beautiful van. Lynn's got already gone inside, so she absolutely loves it, I presume. The doors are a lot wider now on these new vans than ours. Do do. What do you think? Well, what do you think? I think it's be awesome, isn't it? It is beautiful van. Is this the same one Bob's had? No. The king of YouTube. No, he's had twin beds for a start. He hasn't had what? Yeah, he's, he's got twin twin beds oh, and then. I can't remember if it's got an end bathroom or mid bathroom. I don't know, table there. You drop down bed. Which loads of people have, loads of you lovely people have put us off. <laughs> How much is it? Saying they, uh, you'll have trouble and they crack the brake and whatever. Which is probably right to be honest. It's 103 grand. If we bought this. Hang on, I couldn't buy this. <laughs> I know, I was joking. But you could make that area up into a bed. Yeah. But then that defeats the object of buying one for the rear lounge. Yes. Lovely seating area at the back. A window at the back as well. You've got your skylight up there. Very comfortable. I don't like these. I think these spoil spoilers. Just don't like them. Be better off with a proper door. But you can't have a proper door because the fridge is there. What? Nice though, isn't it? It's beautiful. Lovely bathroom, the shower goes over the wheel. This is always a bit of a bugbear of mine, but it's still a nice van, nice little sink. You got a cupboard there and you got me there. I thought we were looking around that today. Yeah, we'll just do this one and we've yeah, and then we'll do some tomorrow. But this really is a beautiful van. Got the new auto box with your car play system there. I'm not moving till you buy it. <laughs> you know what I've noticed about all these uh, Swifts? What's that? Everyone you go in. Because we know this because we've had three of them changed. The door. I've kept the same style door. You know that door? That's the same as ours. That is exactly the same. Yeah. And that's on all Swift models, that is. But uh, yeah, this is a beautiful van, no doubt about it. I'm not too keen on this though. You don't like curtains, you don't like those. What do you like? I like you. Ah, oh, shut up, Robert. Okay. Right. Put your feet on the floor. Put your feet. <laughs> oh, great. Well, right, come on then. No. What do you mean, no? I'm not leaving. I'm going to stay in here until somebody buys it and I'm going to go off with them. Seriously? It sounded well, didn't it? It did. I meant travel with them. Got it. I can't believe you just said that. Hang on, that deserves one of them. Don't. Got a whacking bruise on my arm. Yes, she's got a bruise on her arm, apparently. I don't know, that's something. You've probably walked into something. I don't know about you, Lars, but the older I'm getting, but well, you don't bruise. We were on about this earlier. No. But I bruise so easily. No, that's true, that is. I mean, that was your nipple from the other day when I slapped it with a remote. No bruise. Uh, yeah, I can knock myself base a lot. I'm, I'll never get bruised. I'll never bruised. I'll get the baseball back, my whacking one. Yeah, wouldn't surprise me at all. Yeah, it's very nice, man. Yeah. Loads of height as well, you know. Because it's got a drop down bed up there. It goes, I don't know, it just seems you've got loads. Is that, can you stand up a sec? There. Yeah, because it hasn't always got a step there. Yeah, we step up into our lounge, don't we? Yeah. Like that kind of thing. Yeah. But it's there on us. So you step up which into is the lounge. That way. Yeah. But this drops away, which is better. Yes. Yes. Very nice. Absolutely beautiful van. And that cupboard there goes into the uh into the garage, I presume. Yes, and there's your garage. Let me get down, get under. Not a very wide door though, so we would struggle. In scooters in that. Hang on, what's the other side? Yeah, same size door that side. But yeah, it's a nice one. Very nice one. And then you've got the cracking, beautiful table there, which comes out like so. And that seems pretty solid as well, to be honest. 
Got USBs and plug sockets everywhere. A couple of wardrobes in here. And your Audi wet sensor heat in there. And you've got another one there. Plenty of room, plenty of storage. Little cupboards though, I must add. Very little cupboards. Oh, what on me, I'll tell you about this. Because that is your rollout. Under there is your bolts and whatever. Now, we didn't know this until somebody told us. Because those under there, they get that cold because they're on an outside wall and that's steel bolts. Causes condensation inside. That's a tip we had, isn't it? Yeah. So we have to put the uh, the bags in the wardrobe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just those Which... there. You know, especially you go to Scotland or somewhere, somewhere it's really cold. Those are really cold. And then it causes condensation in there. Because your heating comes up from there. There you go, folks. Just thought I'd tell you that. I'm not sure on this grey. Oh, right, come on. Not sure at all. I'll see you, loves. The grey reminds me of Shrewsbury Prison. We're back in the van, people. We are, we've still got half an Stating hour Stating the obvious. Half past two it is, and they've just chained the gates back up. There's a few, there's four vans waiting to go on three o'clock. It's rather late. It's ridiculous, isn't it? I just let you on. It's only because you wanted to get hammered. I do not want to get hammered. What do you want to do then? Have a drink. All in six. I am on holiday. There are some cracking vans there. Panel vans, caravans. The stock levels are the biggest we've seen since before lockdown. That's very really true. There, there are loads here. Loads of vans. Used vans and new vans. Yeah, we. Uh, I think we, we're going to go, to go around tomorrow and try and do as many vans, motorhomes and caravans as we can. But there's so many. And we've met so a, many. And we've met a few people that recognise us, so yeah. that's always good. Good, Yeah, lovely, isn't it? It is, and that food is absolutely beautiful. Isn't it? I don't know, it's repeating on me a bit now. I think we should uh, cook in here tomorrow. But you said you're cooking. Well, I am. We've got the microwave uh, meals. Microwave meals, again. So you can either have a curry <laughs> or a cooked dinner. Are you going to cook both days? No problem at all. Uh, and I'll even wash up. What, two forks? The only problem I think we've got here is there isn't any bins. There's no bins? And because we popped home on the way out to pick all the parcels up, we've got loads of cardboard from Amazon. Because you've got all, you've got your things for your mod, haven't you, that you're ordering. Yeah. Uh, I bought treated Mavis to a new bed because hers is four years old. And it's... It's going into going into holes now. So I'm just keeping my eye out because I'm going to get in there first. <laughs> I don't know where we're going to park. I'll show you when we pull on. But it's uh... yeah, unless you're into motorhomes or caravans or caravans. Which everybody watching us, I would presume you all are. Yeah. Oh yeah. But if you're not, don't come on this rally. Well, why would people be what even? Oh, shut up, Robert. Everybody loves having a nose round. I've seen some. I'm I've, not saying they don't. I'm just saying there's nothing to like walk into or whatever. I can't believe there's a van. I don't know if it's identical to this, but it's six thousand pound dearer than we paid for it. Yes. Four, four years ago. Yeah. Same, same age. Twenty twenty place. Yeah. We'll show it you tomorrow. Yeah. On Thursday for you. It's more money than we pay for this. Brand new. It's mental, man, absolutely mm. mental. The couple we were just talking to, they're looking at panel vans, aren't they? And they just said the prices are just going up and up and up. They just don't seem to be levelling out at all. Nah, it's making a quick killing, aren't they, everybody? All these dealers are going to rip us all off. Oh, stop your mate. Oh, he has got one on him. Are you feeling any better now? Mm. No. I think, I think I've got a temperature. Can I stand outside, then? Very warm today. It is very warm. Compared I got the door open, folks. It's that warm. It's, it's 17 degrees. That's like the hottest day of our summer well, in according, this country. According to my phone, where we are at the moment in Leicester, it's going to be 19 degrees tomorrow. You have to get your mankini on. No problem. I'll oh, put that on. You won't. Don't bother me. I'll put it on. Oh no. 
doesn't even bear thinking about. I'd walk around naked, I don't care. Yeah. Something seriously wrong with you. Seriously. You having a snog tonight? No. See, look at this panel van that's just coming to this Adria. See that van there? That's beautiful, that is. You filming? Uh, Pat, what? You just noticed you filming. Oh, did I? <laughs> I think uh, they've actually come on the rally and thinking you can get on and. Panel vans are so popular now. Really are popular. Because you can go anywhere in them. You can I go do... anywhere in this. He's just said when we're. Of course, you're starting to sound like George. Um, you know what I mean. Um, you just said if it wasn't for you, I'd be swapping ours for a panel van. A Pacific panel van, the one with windows. Specific. That's all I said. Uh, yeah, going back to motor homes and panel van, I'll park this anyway. I've been, we've been on Tesco's, we've been the only place we haven't been is through drive through on McDonald's. But we'll just put it down anyway. We put it on McDonald's car park, a few of them. We have, yeah. We put the, where, did, where were we? I don't know, we were somewhere. But uh, yeah. I'm, it's just confidence thing, isn't it? Stratford race course. Yeah, you know, just put it anyway. Oh. Sorry for not paying as much attention. We like this, aren't we, both of us? Playing tennis. <laughs> Looking at the vans coming and going. It's a great place. Right. See that panel van just pulled in front of me. He thinks he's going to get in first, but he's not. Does it matter? Yes, right. I was here first. So? I want to get the best spot. There isn't a best spot? No. It's not a very good park up, is it? No. It's not one of the best rallies. But we wanted to come here for a specific reason, to go and have a look around and yes. see what there is. But the thing is, you can get so carried away. I mean, I was just in one thinking, should we do it? Should we do it? What, a tag action? No, well, yeah, the tag, but just can't afford, can't justify it. Can't afford it, you mean? Well, yeah, there is that. Well, we could. We could, we could. But, but nah, I don't know. Let's we'll see. So like I keep saying, the older you get, you, you can keep taking money out. You just don't put it back. That's a fact. And we have got a beautiful motorhome. We, we have. have. And so stop keep on about swapping your motorhome. It's not me. You're the one who started, and then I get carried away, and then I'm the one that says no, no, calm down, calm down. There's another one. Come here, look. I'm going to be last on. I am here. Mm -hmm. Look, look at this. You think she's jump in the queue? There you go. Look. You might be helping, so we might be allowed on. Helping? Helping do what? I'll let his no, toys down if he, they're if they're he gets in there first, I'm going to let his toys down. They do different have different marshals, don't they? So he could be a little helper. Because yeah. they have more than one. If that camera doesn't fall out the door, it's very windy. Well, not I position that camera? It was rocking the boat. It's bloody warm, isn't it? It is warm, it's lovely. I think we'll have to sleep on top of the court tonight. What? What? I'm actually going to put the, take the summer bed, the winter bedding off. Soon. Take that jump off as well, it's horrible. I love it. It hurts my eyes looking at you, well, hang don't, on. Don't look at me. <sighs> That's better. Bloody hell, you are bright. It's the brightest you've ever been. <laughs> At least I am bright. <sighs> oh, great. Got my bloody glasses in here. Right, come on then, turn this off a bit. And we'll put you back on when we get in there. If ever we do. We might be spending the night on the car park. Oh, pat me on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, going back to that. When we were with people, obviously people we know, and it's like, I don't know, quiet, and they'll like walk past the van. I blast the horn. He, do, he does it to me all the time, anyway, wherever I'm like, it's... <laughs> Funny, man. You're not there, you're an idiot. Especially Georgina. She jumped a few times, you know. Last week. And that's hard for her, isn't it? <laughs> Rude. Right, we'll get set up, folks. What? Will we? We won't need a diesel each on today anyway. No, we won't. I might put it on just to... Pee me off? Yeah. Oh, come on, let's crack on. Get. It's another bruise. Yeah. Yeah. Stop! I'll show you my bruise after. Yeah. She's been calling me Rob the Rotter all day. You didn't do it. I don't know actually how I did it. 
You keep walking into things, don't you? So you're not really gaining on our little legs, you know. You're not there, are you? No, I'm always falling over. It's always falling over and always walking into things. Hey, stop looking out the window, look at me. To look at you. Come on then. Let's go. Where are we going? <laughs> Bloody idiot. Well, Holy. we're back in the van. And then we're back in the van. Oh, it could be anybody's van. We're no, back in the van. You look very pretty and pinky and diesel top on. That's second hand. No. Huh? You bought, I, I bought this when we went to Worcester. You mean I bought it and didn't know about it? No. Oh, bruise. Eddie's look. How you done that? I haven't got a clue. Woke up with it. <laughs> I'm sure it wasn't there yesterday. She's the only woman in the world that wakes up with a bruise. I am sure it wasn't there yesterday when I went in the shower. Got up this morning. I got a bruise. Clumsy little git. Right. So, yes, we were at Loudon's. Uh, we were on a rally. Six pound per night, as I said. And all that goes to charity. So, yeah. that's good. Yeah, that is good, yeah. What charity... What charity it is, we don't know. But it's not Robin Lynn's charity, unfortunately. No. Uh, not our dementia charity, no. Or our charity. <laughs> Help Robin Lynn. Uh, yeah, all you've got on here is uh, fresh water awesome. and uh, Elsa Point. Yes. I think you've got to take your rubbish home with you, as I said before. But it doesn't matter. Nah, it's a six quid night in it. And, we, and you know, if you, if you like vans and that, it's perfect. And there's a coffee shop, as you saw, with a little cafe there to yes. have a sandwich or something, or a jacket potato. And tons and tons and tons of vans, motorhomes, camper vans, and caravans, and an accessory shop. So we will take you around there on the next one. Bloody hell, are you plugged into a power bank? <laughs> so not camper. No, uh, nobody's that bad. <laughs> Yeah, so we'll, we'll wrap this one up, people, and we'll catch up with you on Thursday when we really show you around the vans, take our time and show you around some vans. Yeah, because he does ramble on and on and on and on, so this is why this video is going to be over 30 minutes long and we'll have done nothing. <laughs> oh, we have had a laugh today, we? We, have, we do have some laughs, you know, we do, we just do. on our own, you know. It's, yes, it's, uh, it's just been... over silly things like I'm sure most of you do. It's been a funny day. I mean, we just look at each other and burst out laughing. Oh, I do that every morning. I look at him and <laughs> behave. <laughs> Where's my remote? It's in the cupboard. Yeah, so on that note, people, we'll say our farewells after we've had a kiss. No, get, carry on. So stay safe for the caravan as most of tend to drift with scars all new. We still love you. We do. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you on the next one. In a bit.